What's up chickies? It's Baron. Today we're going to be going over some stuff to do with Star Citizen and the new PU monthly report that we've gotten. Don't forget to go and watch this video all the way through. It really does help. It really gets these videos pushed. Also want to thank Dylan Perry for becoming a channel member and I want to thank the real Ronald Dump for resubscribing. You didn't have to man. Honestly, you're a part of this community regardless. It doesn't matter. But I hope you've enjoyed this and I'll see you on the other side. Now, obviously there's been a lot of speculation through this year. And again, I want to let people know that the server meshing is persistently getting worked on. It's never going to stop. If we're getting a static version of it, they do apparently want to get it to 100 people this year. I haven't seen this anywhere, but that's what people are saying. But I want you to read this top part. Now, I didn't really have time to go through this all day, but I would have read over some parts that I'm interested in. But... Uh, Morio Kiri in our community uh, pointed this out that says with Alpha 3.17 approaching fast many teams spent the month finalizing tasks for the impending release however significant progress was made on important features coming later this year including pyro and salvage read on for everything done throughout March so obviously they're telling us pyro is coming this year so worry not it will come sooner or later it looks like it's going to be quarter three but people are being losing a bit of faith. I do admit I did lose a little bit of faith myself. But again, it's just one of those things. Obviously, everything's changing so much. There is some ship information in here, some ship news. So going into this, obviously, you got some vehicle features coming in as well. Uh, so the vehicle team features team was working alongside AI on behaviors that will benefit both the PU and Squadron 42 so that sounds really really great so going on to the art in ships so the UK um, we're working on the Halle so it's currently being closed out for release in 3.17 so it is in the PTU at the current state of time the Scorpius is looking for a point um, a dot X patch so I wouldn't be expecting that anytime soon they well whenever they bring their .x patch out that will be coming with it whenever you know it has become ready like it says here obviously cockpit was finalized including lighting and LODs while the Banu Merchantman progressed through to the exterior R&D phase now I didn't really know what R&D meant so if anyone knows let me know down in the comments but we sort of um Morio sort of well Mori came to the conclusion that it could be research and development it sounds like a good enough for me but let me know down in the comments what everyone else uh, knows what it is or you know has more experience because I, I don't really go through these monthly reports I'll give them a skim over but I won't really go through them too much I sort of base everything off um, the content that I see through the Star Citizen YouTube channel and some other forms of fashions of getting it through different discords so obviously there's three unannounced vehicles and I don't know if they've actually um, officially made the mule um, the expanse sort of you know um public or uh like an announced announced vessel so one of those could be the expanse and one could be the mule i'm not too sure i could be wrong but there's three of them coming uh one is in the final art completion so that could be here for invictus uh one is in the early stages of white boxing so we may see something in the next isc but seeing that the isc is going to be delayed for a while because jared is like relocating over to uh the uk there very well could be something else i don't i don't know we'll just have to wait and see and see if there's any progress gets made or anything gets announced but again we'll probably have to wait for that sale so you know um the US, in the US, the team has moved on to the Drake Vulture, so I moved, I've seen this a little bit. Um, so it, obviously it's down the pipeline a little bit further. They have put a little um, bit more into the cab for the salvaging modes and whatnot. So that'll be really interesting to see, especially using the lasers and when you're intaking the salvage. So that's going to be really, really freaking cool. I can't wait for salvaging. That's probably one of the biggest things that I'll be doing when it comes to. It'd be really great if the Reclaimer got its ability, but we will have a... Um, what do they call it? The Vulture. We will be given a Vulture so we can do the game modes and whatnot. So obviously there has been some progress made on the Corsair as well. The, uh, the Copilot dashboard was designed, built with an overhang for better visibility while the Copilot seat is nearly complete and now features a mechanism that moves it down into its final position. So if you have seen it, when you actually, before you even hop in it, 
the pilot seats in front and the co-pilot seats in the back and then the co-pilot seats will, will seat will go under the pilot seat so if you haven't seen that we have got a deep dive on that explaining it and sort of showing you how it's supposed to work but there are some images of it around as well so don't be alarmed but that will be awesome to see that in its final stages so um, the ship's foyer was finalized work on the turret interiors began and development kicked off on the crew quarters engineering room the team also progressed through the exterior gray box with work moving on from the completed nose back towards the tail so this sounds like there's some really good progress through this update now obviously i'm not really interested well i am interested but i'm not really entirely interested on the actual other content features here i'm more interested on the ships and bringing that news to you guys but it sounds like the banu merchantman's making some good progress it does look like it's going to be a quarter four maybe quarter one of next year release they could be pulling that back once we get some of the ships that we are expecting now we also got some mercury star runner derelicts coming we've got the reclaimer derelicts as well so those are going to be really freaking cool and what will be even better is if there's like loot and salvaging loot within the Reclaimer derelicts as well. So that would be something really awesome to see. Now, if you could grab like components from them for your Reclaimer, that would also be really awesome. There's just so much good stuff coming. And obviously they have, well, pretty much officially said that Pyro is coming this year. So for all of you that are freaking out, like Pyro's not coming. It's coming. Just give them time. Just let them work on it. Don't keep making all these assumptions. I know I put out that video that I put out. But again, it's just so much coming that we just need to sit back, enjoy the patches that are coming and the content that they're adding into it. Because it looks like they're trying to cram them with as much content as they can. Obviously, a lot of it is to prepare us for Pyro. Obviously, the fueling system, the refueling system for this Star Fair isn't really... Well, it can be used within Stan, obviously, if someone were to run out of fuel. But at the same time, it's there for Pyro. It's Pyro is going to be a massive system. Like, if you don't know how big Pyro is going to be, it's going to be like. <laughs> I don't, if you haven't seen it, go into. I'm pretty sure you got the um, where you can have a look through all the different systems and whatnot. But go have a look at that, and you won't be let down because there's so many cool systems and Pyro. Nicks are going to be so big compared to Stanton so you're going to need some good jump drives and some good fuel consumption over there so let me know what you think of these series like these episodes that I've been doing lately I do like doing this sort of stuff it's really really good I, I don't know why but I just seem to enjoy it a little bit more it just gets me on level with you guys and it just feels a little bit more natural and I can just I don't know I just feel a little bit better about doing these but Banning Merchantman's coming Pyro's coming don't worry, this year's going to be a good year, and I'll see you in the verse.